Welcome to Ajax Reviews, guys. It's been a minute, man. Let's talk about what I've been up to. So it's been a hot minute since I've posted anything or made a video, and there's several reasons for that. Um, so I'm just gonna get into it, let everybody know. So the month of August was a crazy, crazy month. Um, it was actually the month of my birthday. Uh, my birthday was August 3rd. Uh, three days after that, we got the news that a good friend of ours was in a car accident. Uh, Head-on collision, actually. And in that accident was our good friend, her husband, and her nine-year-old daughter. Um, they were driving from their town an hour away to the town that I live in to go shopping for the little girl's birthday. On the way, they were in a head-on collision. Unfortunately, the husband and the little girl did not make it. So that was, it was pretty traumatic. It was a pretty tough time. They're really good friends, they're like family. And the little girl was really good friends with my daughter and my son. And it was just a really tough, thing to, to, to go through for me. I mean, I couldn't imagine the mother. That, that started the downward spiral. September 3rd was the funeral. She asked me to photograph her daughter's funeral. So I did. Uh, that was pretty tough as well. Here's where it gets really fucking good. Shortly after that, actually, no, I'm sorry. It was two days prior to that. I get a phone call from my uh, realtor company and they're like, um, the lady that owns your house passed away and now her, her lawyer owns it and he's selling every house on the block so you got 30 days to move. Now, I had just finished purchasing a bunch of photography equipment because as some of you know, some of you may not know, um, I'm a photographer, I like to take pictures. I wouldn't say I'm a, a good photographer, a professional photographer, but I, I, do, I do my best. And so I just bought some portrait studio stuff and was <laughs> eager as shit to set it up. Well, that next day is when we got the call. So I never got to set it up. I, uh, I had already had two videos recorded that I haven't edited yet, that those are gonna be the next two that come out. So if it looks different, the sound is different, it's because it was recorded at my other place. Um, those videos were coming out, but I had two videos recorded and a couple movies that I had watched that I had taken notes on that I had not filmed videos for. So anyway, <laughs> the, the month of August was very traumatic. The month of September was spent packing, <laughs> packing up a three bedroom house with a two car garage to move it into a smaller three bedroom house with a single car garage. Um, I film all my videos in my garage. Um, so going from a two car garage to a one car garage is pretty tough, especially since the two car garage also doubled as my horror room, um, as you guys saw in earlier videos. So the entire month of September was spent searching for a place, packing, um, getting funds ready, getting, putting money aside so we could move, um, and then finally moving. And just yesterday, I was able to, I guess, finish <laughs> the garage that I'm currently in where I'm filming this video. Um, so, I mean, as soon as I was able to, to, to fit stuff in here to film this, I was, I did. Uh, what you can't see is behind me, behind my green screen, there are boxes <laughs> just stacked high as shit. So. It's, it's not, so it's not that I didn't want to film videos. I wasn't growing tired of doing this. I wasn't bored. I didn't get lazy. Uh, what happened was some traumatic shit. And with that traumatic shit came some more shit. It was like a downward <laughs> spiral, like trickle down, man. It just trickled down. Um, so now I'm finally able to start doing some videos again. So I'm going to start watching some more horror movies. I did watch Halloween Kills. I may be doing a review on that. Um, but there was something else I wanted to discuss, and that's the state of horror on YouTube. I've recently come across several YouTube channels, I guess you'd call them, that have 
a lot of fucking subscribers, a lot. And the people that are doing these these channels are <sighs> what's a nice way to to a nice word to use? The fucking idiots, I guess. And I, I'm not sure if I should make videos talking about these people and showing why I call them fucking idiots with you know clips of what they're saying and me responding because the information that they're getting in a lot of these videos is just 100% in fucking correct and makes. It makes the horror genre look fucking stupid. I'll give you a, a quick example. Um, one person said that everything that happened in the original Halloween had to do with sex. Uh, Michael Myers standing in the backyard behind sheets had to do with sex. Um, him wearing the sheet on his head had to do with sex and that, that Deborah Hill and John Carpenter put, put it in there for those reasons because of sex. And I'm just like, are you fucking stupid? But then there's also people that are reviewing movies that are getting facts about the movie wrong. A person dies a certain way and they're saying this happened. No, you're, you're fucking wrong. <laughs> so pretty much what I'm asking is, what do you guys think? Should I go that far? Should I go to these other pages and take their footage and respond to it, react to it? I mean, a lot of people tell me I should. People that are around me, they're like, man, you should just go after these people and I'm like, you know, I don't want to really start any shit. So, especially after the, the last couple months I've had. So anyway, that's what I've been up to guys. Um, I'm going to kind of keep this video short because I'm, this is my very first setup. I just finished setting this shit up and I don't know even how it looks. I'm going to edit this. I'm going to post it up for you guys today, October 18th. There it is guys. That's what I've been up to, man. Um, you may have noticed in one of the other videos, I did dedicate the video to Joshua and Willow Hodges. Those are the people that we lost in the car accident. So, um, yeah, so there's that. Um, I will be seeing you guys very, very soon with some new, uh, some new reviews. Two coming up that I filmed at my other house, so get ready for those. So until next time, guys, stay smart, stay clean, keep the dream. Don't let the man get you down. Because if he does, something else happens. I don't know. <laughs> Later.